Hey guys, we finally crossed 10,000 subscribers and thank you so much. I'm so 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 excited about it. I've been so caught up these days that I didn't realize I crossed 10,000 subscribers to be precise. 10,500 subscribers and it's so exciting. So for that I've decided to answer your questions and hence I'll be doing a video of 21 questions with me. Well, my phone is just five person charge. Shit. Anyways, so um, forgive me if I mispronounce your names because you see proper nouns and all of that. But I'll try my best. Uh, so the first question is by Himanshi Nandwani. How old are you? Hi Himanshi, I am 17 years old. I will be turning 18 this August. Yup, old. Right. So the second question is by. Denisha, did you color your hair? Hi Denisha, yes I colored my hair uh, right before my South Africa uh, trip which was in April. I colored my hair sort of ombre which is this uh, which is this uh, sort of ombre golden and uh, you know blonde and brown and I really like it so yeah. Number three is by Adnan, who is a better YouTuber, Elf Khan or Melvin Lewis? Well, more than an, a YouTuber, I like to consider them as fabulous dancers. Both of them are really, really great. So guys, don't try to get me into trouble by asking me such questions. Both are really good, they're, uh, good on their own uh, dance forms. Like Elf is more into Bollywood dancing and Melvin is into hip hop and you know Western dance styles. And, both of them are really really good in their own ways so I cannot pick one. Number 4 is by Dikshita Mahanta. What is your biggest fantasy? Now this question is fantasy, biggest fantasy I don't really know. I mean bestest, biggest, most favorite. It just doesn't work with me. Well still I would say that you know my biggest fantasy would be to either uh, to be able to go to the past and change and mend and you know heal everything that everything that has gone wrong and you know change things make things make things better and the other would be to you know pause everything pause the world everybody and and you know move around freely eat food for free and do all of that notorious stuff right so number five is Aprajita Aprajita asks what is the best day of your life again this is so confusing well, I don't really have a best day of my life, um, but you see, uh, I have uh, gone to a lot of family trips uh, in many places like Dubai, Australia, Europe, Malaysia, you know, Bangkok, in a lot of places, and and I have had so much fun with my father. So you see all my you know bestest or you know the most favorite memories would be with him so all these trips were fabulous would be all these trips would be the best days of my life number six is by selenator 918 do you miss ssa and your old days well ssa is for those all of those who don't know uh, is uh, shrimanda shakar academy which was my previous school i studied there till uh, 10th standard well, of course I do miss SSA because I've grown up there, I've made a lot, a lot of friends. I have uh, met some genuinely caring and loving teachers there. Although I've had a very good share of bad memories because you see, this teen phase kind of sucks. But I, I've been, you know, things ha have been wrong with me even during uh, the time when I was a kid in that school. So. I've had ba my, my bad memories but then I have a lot of friends and really good friends and all of that so I really really miss my old days in SSA. They were so carefree and you know there was no pressure and all of that. Well uh, number 7 is, is by Satish Singha. Uh, number 7 Satish Singha asks how come are you so cute? Thank you Satish, I don't really know why am I so cute, uh, my parents would have known better but since now I only have my mother so you should probably ask her. Um, number 8 is by article sections clauses, well this is one of my friend. He asks how many times do you say duk paisu on an average day? Well duk paisu is basically an Assamese expression of saying ouch or oops I've got hurt. 
not oops, ouch, I got hurt. So, well, answering that question, I am a lot, I am, uh, I am very sensitive both inside out. So even if you, you know, manhandle me thoda sa and prick me and you know, pull me, I get hurt, okay? So don't do it. Uh, uh, then, number nine is uh, Super Vast Nova. Oh, she is the hashtag asked VT. I really like it. Maybe we could use it from the next time we start making, you know, question and answer videos. So she asks, the best moment of your childhood? Uh, well, the best moment would be one of my birthdays. I don't clearly remember. It was probably my, uh, uh, I think my uh, 7th or 8th birthday uh, when my father threw me this very grand birthday and uh, I had my little friends and he had his friends so uh, we were all dancing on stage and then my father came to me and he was like you know give me a hug and then I gave him a hug and then he said to my friends that in Assamese which basically means my heart is in with her and her heart is with me so probably I, I always think about it and I always have that in my mind and that is one of the best memories uh, number 10 is by Sheetal Singh 21 when are you gonna make a dance video of let me love you well thank you Sheetal for giving me this suggestion well I will surely think of it number 11 is by Karishma Paswan she has two questions Number one is, are you an animal lover? If so, which animal would you love to have for a pet and why? Yes, I love animals and I already have two pets, Coco and Yui. Coco is a Samoyed and Yui is a Labrador and I love, love, love them. I wouldn't want any other pet than a dog. They are the best, they are better than humans. Her next question, which is number 12, is given the choice of anyone in the world, whom would you want as a dinner guest? I love, 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 love Karina Kapoor. Bebo is my all-time favourite. I'd love to have her as my dinner guest and I also know that her favourite cuisine is Chinese and mine is Chinese as well so we could eat delicious Chinese food and you know talk about food stuff right so uh, number 13 is Kesam Sandeep he says hey Arpita just loved your two vlogs that you made it was so good and lol I could have just DM'd you in Instagram but why not be classy and use gmail for a change ooh impressive so that was it, ha ha ha, you know that already, write me back if possible, dada. Thank you so much, Kesam. Um, I really appreciate your idea of sending me uh, your uh, appreciation message in Gmail. And I will write back to you shortly. Number 14 is by Himanshi Nandwani. Uh, which class were you in when you started giving videos? Well, I was probably in 7th standard when I sent my video for DI Little Master Season 2. The Flea Valley, which I uploaded, which actually my sister uploaded from my YouTube account, just like that. There was no motive or intention of being a YouTuber, full fledged YouTuber, and all of that. So that's when I started doing it. And maybe I properly started making videos, you know, only sole for this, you know, sole purpose of YouTube uh, was in 10th standard. So yeah. Uh, number 15 is Nithin Surendra. Can you please dance on Nashe Si Chargai or Ure Dil Pe Fikre? Hi Nithin, I've already made a video on Nashe Si Chargai with Deep Jyoti Pathak. You need to check it out. Go and see that and I'll definitely try to make a video on Ure Dil Pe Fikre as well. Well, number 16, Shanza Nas CR7 asks, I don't think you are Indian, are you? Well, this is something that really bothers me. People ask me questions like if I am from Japan, Philippines, Bangladesh. Well, I'm not. I am from India. I am an Indian. I am from Assam. And just because Assamese is quite similar to Bangla, it doesn't mean that I'm Bengali or from Bangladesh. I mean, they're quite similar, but Assamese is completely different from Bangla. So yes, I'm an Assamese. I speak Assamese, not Bangla. Um, then 17 is by uh, Kawali Sharon. Which grade are you in? I'm in 11th grade and I'm soon going to be in 12th, which sucks. 18 is by Subhashish. What's the one thing you don't leave the house without? Well, I don't leave the house without probably my phone. Yeah, I never leave my house without my phone. Well, school it is different, but sometimes I carry it to school as well. So, yeah. Um, 19 is by Vaishnavi. Is Tejasman your BF? Hi Vaishnavi, I don't really know what you mean by BF. It could be best friend or it could be boyfriend or I could be down. I don't really know. But uh, he's neither of them. He 
is just a professional work buddy. We, we, we used to make videos together and it's been very long since we haven't. But um, yeah, that's all. And I'm, I'm single AF, so the Okay, number 20. We've already reached number 20. Shit. Hemant Kumar asks, are you a classical dancer? Yes, Hemant, I am a classical dancer. I was trained in Bharatnatyam and I'm learning Hotri as well. Whereas, uh, I believe that I uh, should not confine my dancing just to classical because you see, the greatest strength a dancer could have is versatility. So I believe in that and I try to work in all sorts of dance styles. I am self-trained Western dance styles. Um, but I really feel, deeply, passionately feel that classical gives you that strong base which helps you to carry forward or go on into other dance styles. Well, the last question, number 21, is by Priyanka Gogar. Can you do a video about what you eat every day because I'm trying to lose weight and I love your figure. Oh, thank you Priyanka, but let me tell you, I am not really as fit as you think. I am quite plump and you know, healthy because I eat a lot. I don't really have a diet plan or I don't really have a fixed, uh, a fixed type of food that I eat every day. I just eat whatever I want to eat. I feel like eating be it junk food or be it healthy, whatever it is. I eat everything that tastes good probably, yeah. 30% is your workout and 70% is your diet so I think um, you really need to follow a strict diet if you are passionate about losing weight but why do you want to lose weight? I think until and unless you are healthy and you are not obese or underweight I don't think you need to work on that um, but then uh, one suggestion that I would like to give you is that you know dance, just dance along and have fun it's the best way to lose weight you have fun while you know you gain something for yourself so dance along with me watch my tutorials watch my videos i'll help you in that so that's all we've already finished 21 questions i thank you so much for sending in your questions i know i've had a lot of other questions but it's not possible to fit in all in just one video so we will surely have part two the three the fours so make sure to put down your questions in the comment section below or you could just dm tweet with me and snapchat me and instagram me and all of that jazz and um thank you so much guys 10,000 subscribers still goddamn unbelievable but i really 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 love you guys thank you for your support and if you like this video, make sure to give a big thumbs up, comment, share and subscribe. See you later. Bye.